using dynamic web content on your Drupal, Joomla, or WordPress site is actually quite simple. It's as easy as downloading the plugin or the module, installing it, and then setting it up. And let me demonstrate. This is a Joomla website, and I've installed the Modic plugin here. All I need to do is make sure I've set up my base URL. From there, it gets really simple. In my content, I put curly bracket Modic type equals content slot equals slot two. And I'll show you the importance of that in a moment. Some default text to be displayed if the visitor doesn't meet any campaign criteria or no campaigns are present. Dynamic content is associated only with campaigns and there are times where there may not be a matching campaign for a particular visitor. And so the default text is embedded. And then slash modic. If this was a WordPress site, it would be square brackets instead of curly brackets. Where does this slot two come from? Well, you can get a full explanation in our dynamic web content video, but very quickly, it comes from your campaigns. Where the dynamic content is requested, you signify a slot name and define the default content. If the condition is met, then you can push other dynamic content. If the condition isn't met, i.e. the person is not known, they can get even a different set of content. So it's quite possible to really enhance your Joomla, WordPress, or Drupal site with dynamic web content through the plugins or modules from Modic.